Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel again. In today's video, I will talk about an important aspect of Windows management, as I will show you how to uninstall Windows updates using PowerShell. Sometimes, after installing a Windows update, you may encounter problems such as system instability, software incompatibility, or slow performance. And whether you are dealing with a problematic update or simply need to roll back to a previous version, you can remove the update easily. Well, open the PowerShell window, and to perform administrative tasks such as uninstalling Windows updates, you must run PowerShell with elevated privileges. So open PowerShell as an administrator. And without administrator privileges, commands may not be executed correctly. Before uninstalling an update, we need to view a list of all installed updates. So enter the command that appears in front of you on the screen to view all updates installed on Windows. I will leave the command in the video description for easy access. Once you execute the command, it will list all the updates installed on your Windows 11 computer. Along with the list, you will find that it describes the update, whether it is a security update or an update. You will also find the hotfix ID, which is the knowledge base number for the update, and the user account that installed the update, and finally the date on which the update was installed. Then select the knowledge base number or hotfix ID that you want to remove and enter the command that appears in front of you on the screen. I will first try to remove a security update. In some cases, you cannot uninstall security updates using PowerShell. Since security updates cannot be deleted from your computer because your computer needs them, which is why you see this message, but regular updates can be deleted easily and I will try that with you. Retype the command, but this time select hotfix ID as a regular Windows update. And once you execute the command, Windows will start removing the update and a confirmation window will appear asking you if you want to uninstall the update. In the Windows Update standalone installer, click on the Yes button to start the removal process for the update you entered. Uninstalling the update takes only a few seconds, and some updates require a system restart to completely remove the update and apply the changes. But in all cases, it is best to restart the computer after removing the update, and you can verify the uninstallation by restarting the command that lists all installed Windows updates. And if it does not appear in the list, then it has been removed successfully. That's all with simple steps. You can now successfully uninstall a Windows update using PowerShell, and this method is incredibly useful for troubleshooting errors due to recent updates, especially when dealing with problematic updates that cause performance issues or software conflicts. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel for more tech tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.